OK. We are on the Warrego Highway again. I don't know. It, this road is um, it's not a bad road. So anyway, we've got a bit more of this ride to do. We've been at a half hour, I think. Then we're going to turn off at um, at, at a street. But anyway, um, there's so it's pretty much getting it used to be a bush area years ago. It's become more suburbia every time I come out here. I think just around the corner here, on the left-hand side, there's a big housing estate being built. Yeah, things change. Can't stop progress. Okay, we're still... Yes, we're still riding along the... Um, Warrigal High here, uh, we're not far plains lands I think, there's a hotel around the corner here somewhere, down the flat, I think it's down around somewhere here, and then we're going to turn off, not much further past that, and um, yeah, this is the Lockyer Valley RV, Church over there. This Shell service station here, it's called Rusty's. That's been here for years, that service station. It's um, used to be a really old looking place, but they've done it up. But yeah, it used to be that's a privately owned Rusty's. Looks like they've kept the name Shell. Over here with the, the big elephant, bit of um, bit of art on the back of that um, building there, a big octopus. It's a dance studio by the looks of it. There we are, entering Plains Land now. Welcome to Plainsland. There's a police officer. He just going past. Must be um. Must be. Must have heard this donuts. Fresh donuts in the shop. As you can see, there's a Bunnings out here as well. Bunnings is everywhere. Up here on the left, there's the um, Plainsland Hotel. That's, um, that pub was actually moved back about 50, 100 metres to actually allow for the new road to go through. So yeah, just a bit of a a bit of a fun fact there. <laughs> this here is called the Meetings to Stop Cafe. I don't know if you can see that. There for years. Always meant to stop there but never did. Anyway, made on the way back. Anyway, so it's all 100 k's here. This is all cattle land out here, I'd say. Look at that lay leaf fire. Look, fire still five kilometres. That's our destination for today. There's a little sheep over there.
Actually, floods out here back pretty well when it rains. A little big flat plain land, cool flat, as far as you can see. There's some wide water around as well. Some sheepy, more sheepies there, must be, must be sheep country out here. That looks like an old church, doesn't it? We can remodel as a house. Truth be probably is an old church. Going getting that way, we're not going to get, right? What's over here? It must be a uh, must be growing veggies or something over there. Those things. There's quite a few of them anyway. Welcome to Forest Hill, eh? Where all the magic happens. Okay, the main street, street is Victoria Street, there's a big water tower across there, so um, that would be a prime, prime thing for water painting, for a, um, a silo painting or something, but up here, here's the main street by the looks of it, maybe, maybe not, uh, maybe it's over there, yep, over here it is, there's a hairdresser there, kind of a slope of business, okay. There's a the Lockyer Hotel there. So that's the Forest Hill Bottle Shop. Just want to look up here first. Because these silos over here is apparently going to be the next um, or that they're looking to getting um, getting them painted, you know, for um, you know, obviously part of the silo trial throughout Queensland. They'll be um, definitely a big ass silo, definitely a big paint on it anyway. It will be. So I should be done probably um I don't know probably this time next year maybe so right now they're actually looking at getting funding apparently so um no doubt I will be back this time next year uh, I'm just interested I'll probably paint I'll probably um paint this side I'd say most time I paint um 
on the side where the um, train or something goes through. But because there's more access probably to um, to this side, they'll probably actually, um, I'd say they may paint this side, not too sure, but they're definitely big silos anyway. Oh, well, that's why one of the reasons I came out, I actually wanted to check it out before I come and see, um, before I can book, before and after shot, yeah? But anyway, I'm going to stop at a cafe. So we get something that, something maybe to eat. There's one pub, there's two pubs. It's a little town of actually, I think it's like 890 people live in his town. Look at how close the pubs are. <laughs> right on top of each other. Back there, I'm going to stop. Uh, man, people, some people ride really, really slow, some people. Okay, I'll just stop had a <laughs> just had a toasty series at Cafe 4342. Ten dollars for a toast of cheese, my lord. But it wasn't too bad. Got some um art over there. Anyway, we're heading back to Logan. I didn't think I'd ever pay 10 bucks for a toasted cheese sandwich, but I did. So what does that tell you, eh? <laughs> Who's the fool? Them for the prices they're charging? Or me for paying it? I don't know. So yeah, that's as far as Hill, eh? It's like a memorial. There you go, it must be for the war, eh? Yep, 1914 to... Yep. Keep that memorial park done up well anyway. Ah well, we're going back, <laughs> back home. Wasn't bad. Wasn't bad ride. Good ride actually. I'm going to guarantee, but she'd be cold out here at night time at least. Well, that's the that's the forest hill service station by the looks of it. Petrol station. Anyway, we are now farewell to Forest Hill. I'll see you in a year's time, mate. We're going to go to Gatton, there you go, it's the way to Gatton. There's another garage there as well, a little small garage. Cool. 
Yeah, so yeah. Yeah, so that diner, Cafe 4342, four, I think it was. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Um, had to wait a while to get a fucking taste of cheese sandwich. I couldn't believe it. I must have been out churning the butter or some shit. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, I was there for like fucking 20 minutes. Or it felt like 20 minutes waiting for it. So, but anyway, but it did taste all right, I must admit. It wasn't bad tasting, so. But yeah, ten dollars, mate. I fucking wouldn't want to be fucking bad tasting, would it? Eh? But anyway, I paid it. I'm happy. I, I contributed to the town. Bought a fucking coke for four fifty, which is fourteen dollars fourteen fifty day, mate. Fourteen dollars and fifty cents. So anyway, it's all done now. Oh, the, oh, the horse is dead. Or he's on the rest. I hope he's just sleeping. Okay, back to home now. Oh. As I said, that there is the um, next site apparently for the painted um, towers, painted silos. So um, right now they're looking for um, oh, they're looking for funding from the government and uh, all that sort of stuff. That to say, those silos are huge. So there is a good um. There is definitely a good um, backdrop to paint on. Just hopefully they don't do like down New South Wales and stuff. They've done um, they've done this Aboriginal looking art one. I thought that's not very good, but anyway, obviously for the for the town, that's what they decided on or whatever they've decided. Hope they do something like um, maybe Cobb and Co or um, you know like rural farmland or sheep, something like that. Something that actually depicts the area. But um, no doubt, just um, watch this space, I guess. I want to um show everyone this meaning to stop cafe. I've never, I've always ridden past it, never stopped. I'm not going to stop here today. Probably should have stopped here, but I've got a cheaper sandwich. But um, yeah, it's actually it's been around for oh, a long, long time. It's been here for meaning the meaning to stop cafe. Um, so yeah, it's been for a long time. 